Welcome to the Creative Kiln. Here's our studio. We have employee pottery for sale there. Aprons right here. Grab a hair tie if needed right here. Pick a pottery wheel. Here's your tools and your water. To start your wheel, push down on the pedal. The further you push, the faster it goes. Push on the back of the pedal to stop. Grab wedge clay and let's throw. Go slow and be gentle. First, we center the clay. Second, dig a hole and stretch it out. Third, take clay from the side and push it in and up into a cylinder. Then we shape. Anchor your elbows to your legs. Take the heels of your hands on the sides and push in and up into a cone. Then put your hand on the side and your fist on top and push down. Squeeze sponge for water. Keep hand on the side angled, fist on top, slowly push down compress. Ask an instructor for help at any time. Then you're going to grab water, put your hands together, two fingers in the middle, slowly push down. Grab water if needed and push down so you have about an inch left. Don't go all the way to the bottom. Then you're going to hold your hands together, fingertips at the base, and pull the clay towards yourself slowly. Two fingers on the walls and sponge on top to smooth out the rim. Smooth out base with a wood rib tool. To do a pull, pinch your thumb into your index finger. It's going to look like this. With the sponge on the outside, put your other hand on the inside with your thumb attached. Push in and up with your outside hand only. Smooth out the rim with your fingers on the wall, sponge on top, then do it again. Now, to do an advanced pull, pinch your thumb into your next finger, put it on the side. You're gonna push with your inside hand first, then push in and up with your outside hand. Lift your hands up and smooth out the top. This is a wood rib tool and a metal tool. To shape clay, push from the outside or hold the tool in place and push from the inside. Don't move the tool on the outside, just your hand on the inside. Make sure not to push too hard with both hands. As you can see, the metal tool makes round shapes. The wood tool is good for straight edges, but can also do round shapes. Start with the wood tool first. To collar clay, hold hands like this and push in and up. To do a finger pull, hold hands like this and pinch gently with fingers and pull clay in and up. Here's some more shaping with either tool. To flare the top, pinch and roll. To do designs, push the point into clay, push in and up or down to do a spiral. Smooth out clay with sponge. Round out the bottom with a trimming knife. Use needle tool to trim the top if needed. Hold it tight, slowly push in till it goes through then pull up. Take your wire tool, wrap it around your fingers tight like floss, hold tight, push down, and slide. Use your bucket to clean pottery wheel. Clean tool bin and front of pottery wheel. Replace tools back into bin once clean. Put chunks of clay in recycle bins. Clean off wheel and inside splash pan. To get under the wheel, push sponge down with four fingers and drag along bottom of splash pan. Remove all clay from pottery wheel and splash pan. You're going to dump your old water into your cleaning bucket. During this session, throw as many pieces. It's good practice to see how consistent and thin your walls are. Once you're done, smash it, recycle, and start again. Throw as many pieces as you'd like and only pay for what you keep. If it's your last piece, have an instructor help take your piece off and clean wheel. Remember, go slow and be gentle and have fun. Thanks for coming.